Hi guys and welcome to Tech Paste. In this video, we're gonna talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the Canary channel, which is the build 25951, the latest build for Windows 11 version 23H2 in the Canary channel. In this video, as always, we're gonna talk about what is new, what has changed, and also what is fixed in this latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the Canary channel. But I can tell you from the beginning that this is a smaller build in the Canary channel compared to others. So if you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to Tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. First of all, Microsoft is providing ISOs for this build, so you can just go into the official Microsoft website, scroll down below, select the edition, the latest build for the Canary channel as an example, confirm, then you're gonna have to select your product language, for example, English United States, and then you're gonna have the ISO available. In this build, first of all, the SMB client now supports blocking NTLM for report outbound connections. This will basically allow IT admin administrators to further extend the settings that they have access to and also the SMB server now supports controlling which SMB 2 and 3 dialects it will negotiate yet again an update for IT administrators and if you want to learn more about these you can check out the article below in the video's description. I think the only notable change in this build is in the lock screen as Microsoft adjusted the network flyout on the lock screen to better match the UI of the network flyout from quick setting and system tray on the taskbar and you're gonna have some screenshots from Phantom Ocean 3 in this case to see the differences between how it looked before and how it looks now. And as you can see, it looks pretty nice. It matches the Windows 11 experience with the Mac effect. I think that is pretty good. And of course, if you are on the Canary or Dev channels, you can go into the Microsoft Store library and click on Get Update to install updates for all your apps. We're not gonna go in depth with it, but I'm just gonna mention some of the app updates because I wanna make a different video about those. First of all, the Windows Photos app gets background blur, search motion photo support and other enhancements. And also the Snipping Tool app is getting text recognition inside screen screenshots and also we have an update for the phone link so I think that is pretty pretty nice and lastly we can talk about two known issues in this build some popular games may not work correctly on the most recent insider preview builds in the canary channel and also Microsoft is investigating reports that the print queue is no longer accessible so this is pretty much the latest build for the canary channel not very exciting this is basically the latest build for Windows 11 23h2 and if you enjoyed this video of course please don't forget to check out the article below for more information and don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Mario from Tech Base. Until next time, have a nice day.